right, boys and girls, and welcome to Gordon Guitar. Ian Dior with a song called Falling. All right, so we have uh, one strumming pattern that will work for this song and four different chords. So let's start with the chords first. We have the G. So that is third on E, second on A, open D, open G, third B, and third E. Right, then we have next chord, D. That is open D, second G, third B, and second E. Then C major seven. That is third on A, second D, open G, open B, and open E. And the final chord is the A minor seven. So that is open A, second D, open G, first B, and open E. And all these chords are played without any capo, okay? So there we have the four chords we need to handle. And before we go through the different chord progression here, we need to look at the strumming pattern, okay? So we will have one basic strumming pattern. The ending will be different and it will alternate. And I'm going to explain what I mean by that. So let's start with the G chord. So the first round you strum will be down, down, up, down, up, down, down. All right. So we will divide it into two parts. So the first part will be just the two downs. So down, down. Okay. And then the second part will be up, down, up, down, down, up. So. Up, down, up, down, down, up. So the first two up, down, up, downs goes a little bit fast. And then you have a small break and then down, up. So up, down, up. So this is the first round you play this strumming pattern. So we learned down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up. And the second strumming round you play will be same start, down, down, and then it will be up, down, up, down, up, down. So up, down, up, down. So again, the first two up downs will be together, so to speak, and then it's a small break and then up down. So up down, up down, up down. Okay, so that is the strumming. So the first round goes down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up. And the second round goes So, when we have this now, we will look at the different chords. So, we'll start with G to D and to C major 7. That is one part of this uh, playing here. So, you will start with the G and play down, down, only part 1. And then you shift to D and play up, down, up, down, down, up. So, let's repeat this, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, and then you play the C major 7, one full strum around, so that means both parts, part 1 and part 2, so down, down, and then you're going to play the second ending, so up, down, up, down, up, down. Right. So to repeat this one, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Okay. So that was the first three chords: G, D, and C major seven. You will repeat this chord progression for two rounds. So again, you're gonna play.
then the next chord progression will be G, D, A minor 7, and C major 7. So here you're going to play again the G, down, down, then shift to D and play up, down, up, down, down, up, and then A minor 7, down, down, and you shift to C major 7 and play up, down, up, down, up, down. Okay? And the final part for the song will be G, down, down, and then D, up, down, up, down, down, up, and you end with just one down on C major 7. So, everything we learned so far, the G, D, C major 7 times 2, this chord progression, and then the G, D, a minor 7, C major 7, and finally G, D, and C major 7, just one down. If you look at this as one chord progression, all that, that is what's going on through the entire song. All right? So when you know this, you just keep on playing, and that pretty much covers Ian Dior's song called Falling. So good luck with this one, guys. See you soon. Don't forget to subscribe and help me here. And play tuned.